Two minutes on the clock, guys. Let's go. I'm Saucy Xmix, the streamer. New face here on Twitch and technical wizard. Today's two minute stream tip is stream credits. Start by downloading <clears throat> the up bar if you haven't already. There will be a download link to this as well as a link to my ultimate guide in the description. Since we're adding a new widget here, guys, we're probably going to want to be adding a new overlay. To do that, we just jump into settings and overlays. Give the overlay a name and then add the overlay in as a new browser source. You guys are going to want to make this full screen. Jump into overlay widgets, select add overlay widget and then select end credits. Give this a name and select the new overlay that we just created in here we can set position on screen scroll speed as well as all of our colors and fonts and font sizes for our headers and body text by the way guys in these color fields you can use either hex codes or rgb codes if you know your html you can also customize any of these html sections which is how i got my glow effect on my title adding new sections is as simple as selecting a section type and hitting add if you want to overwrite the default header you you can just delete out this name and add in your own header. You also have three free form HTML boxes available if you would like to add in custom text. On these though guys you will have to manually update font color, size and family to match your other sections for header and body text as they won't pick up the global fonts and colors. I use W3 scores for this as it's easier to see the text. Once you're happy with how everything's looking, hit save and then press play to test. The credits will play as soon as they're visible, so I added a command which will hide and then show the widget, which triggers when I move to my end scene. Yes, you can run this from your stream deck with a mix it up, integration and a multi-action. And we are done. Two minute stream credits. Enjoy, guys.